National Educator. How are you? I'm good, I'm good. You? What is it? You've come late, I'm okay. No, Molimo was here very, very early. Actually, I was setting up outside. I want us today to have a lesson outside. Where we can bask in the sun, at least avoid all this cold in here. No, 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 no. Today, it may not be necessary because our bodies have a mechanism of warming ourselves. Wait, what? Mm, our is bodies have a mechanism of warming us up. So you don't have to go and bask outside the sun. Is there a biological explanation for that? Mm, yes, we will have it. Huh? Okay. Yes. All right, so let's introduce the show, actually. <laughs> so dear viewers back at home, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of our exciting biology lesson. I'm your host, Jack Mutinda, and of course, I'm with the one and able Molimu. Hello, Lana. I am teacher Mary Kamau, a, bio a teacher of biology. Yes, exactly. It's biology, like I mentioned. Mm -hmm. So, Molim, you say there's a biological explanation mm -hmm. as to why our bodies, as to how our bodies maintain our te temperature. Yes. Okay. First things first. Mm -hmm. Tell us what today we'll be studying and what are the objectives of the lesson. Oh, good. So mm -hmm. today we are in the topic of excretion and homeostasis. Mm -hmm. And today we are going to discuss how homeotherms um, respond to changes in the temperature or the temperature the temperature changes by behavioral means. I guess you see the look on my face. You <laughs> many potatoes. All right. I've said. Okay, let's just go slowly. You said uh -huh. ho homeotherms. homeotherms. Okay, what are homeotherms? So, <laughs> before we come to the homeotherms, uh -huh. we are going to discuss how these homeotherms that I'm going to tell you uh -huh. what they are, and you being one of them, you are a homeotherm. So, how homeotherms okay. respond uh -huh. to changes in, I mean, of um, t in the temp to temperature changes by behavioral means. So you are a homeotherm. Oh, that's why, that's why, that's why back at home when I meet my friend, he'll say, hey, homie, hey, homie, yo, what's up? Well, so homie. Well, well, <laughs> not really, not really. Probably they could be having a different meaning. But here, okay. we are talking of homeotherms mm -hmm. as um, those organisms which are able to maintain their internal body temperatures constant despite the wide fluctuations of this temperature, I mean of the external temperatures. And that is why I've told you, okay, let me take you that again, because mm -hmm. it is like... No, actually, I'm, I'm very sure even the learner has that look like, eh, ah, ah, malim, rudia, yo. Okay. yo so please, let's, do, okay. let's do the definition of homeotherms, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I want to take you very slowly. Okay. You told me we mm -hmm. go out and bask. Yes, we have our lessons. Exactly. And I've said no. no. Our body have a mechanism of uh, maintaining the or warming warming oh, us up. up. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So and I've said you are a homeotherm. I'm a homeotherm. Now, yes. Jack homeotherm. Jack homeotherm. Uh, very Jack good. Homie. Homie. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. So a homeotherm <laughs> is an organism mm -hmm. that is able to maintain its body internal body temperature constant mm -hmm. despite the fluctuations, fluctuations. in the inter external mm -hmm. temperatures. temperatures yeah so even if it is very cold inside mm -hmm. here uh, as time go by mm -hmm. uh, we will get warm okay okay now i have a question on that mm -hmm. why why do 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 these homeotherms mm -hmm. actually have to to maintain that constant body temperature yeah very good because you know there are some metabolic activities that takes place inside the bodies of these organisms uh -huh. and they are able to generate heat from inside 
for example we have um, cell respiration which occurs inside the body inside the body yeah uh -huh. and that way we the, the bodies or we are able to uh, to generate or through that process we are able to generate uh, the temperatures or heat sorry mm -hmm. we are able to generate heat from outside